Are you gonna sit down, Isaac? Looks like that's where he's staying. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are well. So today's video is gonna be something a bit different. I have done one hair tutorial before in I think it was summertime last year. That was how to get some nice summer beach waves. This time I'm going to show you how to get them but heatless. The best thing about this is that it actually works. Normally you see videos where it doesn't work. Yes. <laughs> Say hello to everybody. We are gonna do some heatless waves. Just take an overnight process but trust me it works and I have used it before. It does come out quite thick and like nice and bouncy and things like that especially when you've got when you sleep in it. I'm so excited for this and I've needed to film this for so long and I just haven't but sorry. Also if you want to see how I created this eye look then leave a like or something or subscribe and I will show you that in next week's video. So yeah let's get into the video. So first off what you're going to need is clean hair or a day old hair. That's the best hair that this works on. I'm just going to take mine down. I have washed this today. This is another one of those scrunchies that I make. So I made two Beauty and the Beast ones. And then, and then I made these two as well. What you're going to want to do is, if you have had your hair like me, just give yourself a little head massage because that feels the best. All I'm going to do is just go down the centre best I can. I haven't got a mirror right now, so my camera's doing all the work. I'm just going to a bubble in this one. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna start here and I'm just gonna start with a piece about that thick and I'm just going to start twisting it at the top and then just slowly adding pieces to it and I'm just carrying on twisting it. You wanna kind of make it as tight as possible at the top and I kind of like try and take them as thin as possible um, because that's how you're going to get the best curls um, and the best results out of it. And you want to make sure that you're taking it from bits here as well because you can see it's pulling on the scalp there, that's what you want to do. So you can kind of see this here and this is how we're gonna get the curl it takes a matter of minutes it's so quick and easy so if you don't have enough time to say curl your hair the next day you've got a lot of plans or you just kind of want to cut down your getting ready time because i know i do that a lot where i get ready and then i don't have enough time to curl my hair i will sometimes go ahead and do this and then it's curled for the next day then so I've got this little bit left and this is literally taking me like two minutes to do. Okay, so when you get to here, you're gonna notice that you've got bits left. So I just kind of like get it down the middle and I just start to twist it. So split it in half and just twist it all the way down. To the ends obviously you can have it all the way down to the ends or if you like it where it's just like got little straight pieces at the end so it looks like beachy waves and things like that that's fine this will give you beachy waves as well if you do it all the way to the end though so it does get it's like a workout at the end oh so then i'm just going to start twisting it in a bun at the back like that and you've got to make sure that it's really tight and then I just get a bobble and just just get it and secure it into place and I do also get one of these clear bubbles I put about three bobbles in them just because I want to make sure that they stay in place and then obviously a few grips as well okay, I'm gonna quickly do the other side and then I'll be right back
Okay, so you should now be left with something like this. So all I'm gonna do is just get like the little bits here and just clip them down with bobby pins. Okay, Isaac, okay, where are you going? Sit still. Sit still, you maniac. Where are my grips? So as you can see, it should look a little bit like this. And if you want to, you could just leave it like this. And I feel like I look like um, that woman from Shrek, you know, with the heavy makeup and and the mole and the just like that's what I feel like right now. So what I do now is I literally just leave this in all night, make some food, watch some TV and go to bed. And then in the morning, I will be back with you to show you the finished results. I will see you in the morning, guys. Also, an update. What I also do is pop this in my hair. This is from Soap and Glory and it's just a headband and I'm gonna use this for my makeup, but because it's so thick, I can keep the um, strands, the curls in there and it also just pushes up the buns at the back so they're not drooping you have one of these i highly recommend that you use them you may look a bit crazy but you're not going anywhere are you it's just you and your family so yeah definitely recommend that you use this and i will sleep in this as well so i'll see you in the morning good morning guys it is now thursday and we are going to take these out it is currently 12 o'clock and i did say to myself yesterday i was going to take them out at 12. my head hurts <laughs> I have a really bad makeup day today as well, so don't judge. So guys, this is the end of the video. If you have enjoyed it, then please give it a huge thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below and the notification bell so you never miss a post because I know sometimes it won't show up in subscription boxes. So comment down below, let me know what you think. If you also want to see a look of the pink eyeshadow look that I had on earlier on in the video. And also comment down below, let me know what you think of these heatless waves and if you're gonna try them. And if you do try them, send me a picture on Instagram or Twitter which is at Charlotte Thriston on Instagram or at Charlotte Neve on Twitter. But all my links will be down in the description below. So make sure you go and follow me on all my social medias so you don't miss out on any of the action that goes on in my life. Um, and also just leave down below any requests of videos that you would like to see. I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys, and I will see you all next week. Bye.